What is up, guys? It's your girl, Lady T, the Life Coach, and I'm here today with another video. How are you guys doing today? I just want to come on here and spread some real, true, sincere love because that's what I feel in my heart. I want to uh, send a message to all of you guys. I want to let you know that, listen, that life is good, life is great, and you cannot live your life or you should not live your life complaining about anything. Let me tell you something. I don't have anything in this world to complain about, nothing. Is my life perfect? No, but guess what? I have nothing to complain about. I am completely happy with my life. Are there things that I want to do to improve my life? Are there goals that I have set in mind and things that I want to accomplish? Yes, there are. But guess what, guys? I don't have anything to complain about. And you shouldn't either. Whatever it is that's going on in your life right now, you should be satisfied and you should be content. If there's things that you want to change, you take those avenues, you take those steps to make that change. But guess what? In the process, you don't complain about nothing. Nothing at all. You don't complain about it. You appreciate where you are in your life right now. Until you can do better, you just appreciate it. You, you be content with what's going on, with what you have, with where you live. And then when it's time for you to fix it and to change it, you get up and you do what you gotta do to make it better. But guess what? You don't complain about it. You are supposed to be happy, to be full of joy, to be at peace with everyone. Make sure that you don't have anything against anybody else. And if you do, fix it a friend, a family member, whoever it is, fix it. Because guess what? When you have those kind of things that's going on in your life, there's no way you can have peace. And if you don't have no peace, there's no way that you can move on to the things that you want to do to accomplish the things that you want to accomplish to better your situation and for you to be happy and full of joy and full of peace. There's no way you can do it. So guess what you got to do? You got to clean the slate. Whether it was your fault or somebody else's fault, whatever the case may be, whether it is to forgive or you forgive them or they forgive you, whatever it is, you got to fix that situation so that you are able to move, to expand, to explore, to grow. Oh my God, to do whatever it is that you want to do in life. Because guess what? Whatever you want to do, you will have the power within yourself to get it done. And there's no excuses from nobody else. There's no situation, there's no place, there's no person or no thing that's stopping you from being at your greatest potential, doing what you said you want to do, getting what you say you want to get, going where you say you want to go. Let's get it. No excuses, no holes barred. Let's just get it. Stop blaming people. Stop complaining. Stop making excuses. Get it done. Because you have the power within yourself to do it. And if you don't have nothing against nobody else, and you ain't mad at nobody, and ain't nobody mad at you, there's so much room for you to do what you got to do. All that negativity, all it does is block your situation. And you don't need no blockage. You don't need no distractions. You don't need no holdups. You don't need no obstacles in your way. You don't need none of that. You need to be successful, but you need to be positive about your situation. And you cannot be positive complaining. The key to it is, guys, be content with where you are right now. And then work towards what you want to fix and what you want to see and what you want to improve and what you want to do. That's how you do it. But you don't complain. See, the, you, you have to be happy with where you're at. You have to be satisfied with what you have for right now. Because when you complain, then God is not satisfied with that. God is not pleased when you complain about what you have. The Bible says be grateful for the little things that you have in your life. And then if you're grateful for what you have, he'll bless you with many, many more things. But you got to be grateful for where you're at. People, some people always complain. They're always complaining about what they don't have, what they can't do, what they haven't seen, what they haven't done. You cannot live your life complaining. You can't. 
You, you, you're supposed to be satisfied. Be satisfied, but be ready to get up, to make that improvement, to make that change. Get that tenacity, get that drive, get that endurance, get that fire inside of you and make it happen. But in the process, don't be complaining to other people and don't be complaining even to yourself. Be happy and content, always. And you would, you would, you would be so surprised at the outcome of gratification, at the outcome of just being content and appreciating what you have. You would be so surprised at what things can take place and come about and start to formulate in your life because of your gratification as to where you are right now. I don't live my life complaining about nothing and I don't have everything I want, but I'm gonna get what I want. I don't live my life. I have no complaints. I don't care what I want and what I need and what I don't have. I don't have no complaints. And I'm not going to be around people who have complaints. And all they want to do is complain and make excuses and, and say why they can't do this or that. I don't even want to talk bad about nobody. If you got a negative conversation for me, I don't even want to hear it. Because I got so much room in my heart and so much love for myself that I don't even want to put that inside of me. I don't want to put it nowhere near me. So I'll keep that negativity away from me. Come to me with that love. Come to me with that joy. Come to me with that happiness. Come to me with that peace. Come to me with some jokes. Make me laugh. Make me feel good about myself. Make me feel good about my life so that I can be able to do what I gotta do because of my mindset. I have to have a peaceful state of mind in order for me to be able to move into the direction I want to go. And you have to do the same thing. You can't continue to complain all your life, continue to, to be uh, pouting about everything that you don't have and the things that didn't go your way. You can fix whatever you want to fix. You can change it whenever you want to. Ain't nobody stopping you but you. Nobody is stopping you but you. And all I got to say to you today is, if you be grateful for what you got and where you at, you will make room in your life for more to come. That's the way it works. That's the way it works in this life right here. It works by your gratification, by your contentment, by your satisfaction of being where you are. Life will make room for you. Life will make room for other things to come into your life, to your existence, people that you'll meet to give you resources, to get where you need to go. That's how it works. It doesn't ever work on negativity. It only works on positive vibes. I always talk to you guys about the laws of attraction. What you put out is what you gonna get back. If you put out that peace, you put out that joy, it's coming back to you. If you put out that happiness and that laughter, it's coming back to you. If you put out thoughts of success and being productive and purposeful, guess what? It's looking for you. You don't even have to try to find it. When your thoughts go out there and say that you want to do this and do that and you want to be purposeful, guess what? Purpose is looking for you. You say you're going to be successful, guess what? Success has already started looking for you. You don't have to make that much of an effort. It's just the mind and the way you think. Change it. Stop complaining. Stop pouting. Stop holding grudges against people. Anything that's negative in your life and in your mind and in your mouth, the way you speak, you're holding yourself back from getting what you want to get, from going where you want to go, from doing the things that you want to do. You have to keep everything positive. A low state of mind is a state of mind with no peace. Keep your frequency up high. And when people come around you, you'll be the beacon of light. You'll be the one to make other people happy and make other people positive and give them hope and that they can do whatever they want to do. You be that one. Don't be the one that's always a Debbie Downer. Don't be the one that's always complaining about something that somebody else, now they feel bad because now you around. The Bible says, let your light so shine before men that they would see your good works and glorify your God in heaven. You let your light shine. Be a beacon of light so that others' situations can brighten up. And their mindsets will change as well. You be the impact. 
You be the inspiration. You be the change for other people. Stop it with all the negativity. It gets us nowhere. We can benefit from none of it. And pessimistic people, get rid of them. If they don't believe, get rid of them. Because you believe. You know what you want to do, and so you're going to do it. You got to get rid of those people. They don't benefit you at all. And if you can't change the way they think by your positivity and your attitude, then you have to move them out the way. Because you're going somewhere, and they may not be going with you, but you know where you want to go. And you got to get there. You got to get there. Positive vibes. Gratitude. Happiness and peace. Love. Which covers everything. Somebody hurt you. Forgive. Somebody talked about you. Forgive. Somebody lied on you. Forgive. Because that's the only way you're going to be free. To do what you want to do. You'll never be able to live a purposeful life if you don't let things go. This is the way you'll be able to be successful. You can't forever be bound by people. You can't forever live with that. It's time to move on. I'm telling you, I know because I do it. No, my life is not perfect, but I live like this. So this is why I can tell you it because it's true. I don't have anything in my life to complain about. Do I have bills? Yes, I do. Do situations come up in my life? Yes, they do. Do I complain about it? No, I don't. And I told y'all in another video, I don't have no problems. I only have solutions. So I can walk around and be content. I can be happy. And if you coming around me with that other stuff, you gotta bounce. I'm not dealing with that. No, I'm not dealing with that. And you shouldn't either. Guys, let's be that beacon of light for somebody else. There's so many people out here that's hurting, that need to be encouraged, that need to be impacted, and we may be the very ones that can help them out. We may be the only ones that can do it. But we can't walk around pouting and doing the same thing that they're doing. Let's show some positivity. Let's show some hope and give it to other people. I vow my life to change others' lives. I vow my life to impact others, to make other people feel better. I vow my life to give other people a different way of looking at life. I vow it to my life to do that because that's what we're supposed to do. And I will do it. And I don't care what nobody says. You can complain all you want to. There will be people who will complain about this very video. I don't care. I'm going to be a light that will shine out of darkness. I'm going to be that one. And if there's others who want to follow me, then listen to what I'm telling you. Don't have any complaints about your life. Don't be negative about situations. Whatever comes up, you deal with it. Only 5% only of it is what happens to you. 95% of it is how you handle it. What do you do with it? And it's, it's according to the, what you do, which will be the determining factor of your outcome. So let's be positive, guys. Let's be thankful and grateful for what we have in our lives. I love life. I love people. I do. I don't care if you don't believe me. I love life and I love people. And sometimes people don't even like me because they see that light in me. And I'm always happy. I'm always happy. I don't have nothing to complain about. And so therefore, guys, I'm just giving you some tips. I'm giving you some tips on how to do it. It doesn't mean everything is always going to be great, but who cares? I know how I'm going to handle it. All right, guys, this is your girl, Lady T, the Life Coach. And I just, I just wanted to share that love with you guys. I feel so much love in my heart for people. I feel that people are hurting. People need encouragement. People need words of wisdom. People need to be impacted. And if I can do it, if I can give it, I'm here. That's what I'm here for. This ain't no show. I'm not showboating for nobody. 
I'm not trying to reach fame and fortune. I'm here to impact you. So receive what I'm saying and do what I do. Don't complain about nothing. You have no problems, you only have solutions. Make other people happy. Impact somebody else's life. Change somebody else's situation. And watch the blessings that come to you. I'm looking forward to it. Every single benefit, whatever God has for me, it is for me. All right, guys, this is your girl, Lady T, the Life Coach. And listen, please remember to like, to comment, by all means comment, to share, and to subscribe to my channel. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.